What's up guys, Trilogy here. Today we're gonna to be doing another Pokemon video. I don't know why I'm doing this stuff with my hands. Um, whatever. Anyways, um, I haven't seen a lot of this yet, so hopefully I'm getting ahead of the curve with this, but based off of current information, of course, Pokemon Legends Arceus, 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 whatever. Arceus is, and they may change the stats for these Pokemon and typings and a little bit, they may tweak it, but based off of the current information that we have, I'm gonna be telling you the best starter Pokemon for Pokemon Legends Arceus. So we have Cyndaquil, and then we have Oshawott, Oshawott, and then we have Rollit. Um, so Cyndaquil, of course, is gonna be the fire Pokemon. Fire Pokemon is usually the best Pokemon to go with. I mean, I've done the Sword and Shield analysis, and then I did the Brilliant Diamond and the Shining Pearl, so I'll link those up above. Um, I did both of those, and, and both of those, you'll be surprised, but it was fire. And I have justifications on why those were the best. But typically it's it's fire that's the best one um so we'll see if it changes with this one based off of my personal opinion and my research and what i found like i said on the cute scale <laughs> they're all pretty cute we know rollet wins as far as cuteness goes the um Cyndaquil looks cool but he literally has fire out of him so i can't hold something that's on fire so anyways so we have Cyndaquil, the fire pokemon we have asha with the water and then we have Rolet, which is the owl grass one. So he's gonna be a flying type and grass. So it's nice to have a dual type right from the beginning. Um, so based off of the stats, um, Cyndaquil is going to have the best special defense, the best speed. Um, Oshawa is going to have the best special attack. And then Rolet has the best HP, best attack, best defense, best special defense. Um, so they have the highest base stats as the starting of the game. So if you wanna have an easier start, Rowlet definitely has the best stats, hands down, in the beginning of the game. They are definitely the best starter based off of those stats. We also have to consider, consider immunities, weaknesses, and resistances. So, um, Cyndaquil has six resistances, Oshawott has four resistances, and then Rowlet has three resistances. Um, and then Cyndaquil is weak to three types, um, Oshawott is weak to two types, and then Rala is weak to five times with a four times weakness to ice. Yeah, yeah, that's a tough one right there. It's hard to vouch for something that has a four times weakness. Um, but as long as you don't run into ice, then you should be perfectly fine. I can definitely say that this is still the best starter at the beginning of the game. Even with that four time ice, you just need to have something in your party that can combat ice types. So whenever you run into something ice or you're exploring a snowy region, switch and roll it out because they are not built for ice. Ice will destroy this guy. He's four time weakness to ice, that's horrible. Um, but yeah, basically I will definitely say that based off of these stats, Rala is the best. But on top of that, I wanted to look at the final form. I didn't look at the second gener second evolution, but I did go to the final forms. In that phase, we're gonna have Typhlosion, um, Samurai, and then we're gonna have Decidei. Des I don't actually know how to say his name. Decidei. I don't know, whatever. Um, Typhlosion is going to be still fire. Samurai is still gonna be water. But Decidei is actually gonna be Grass Ghost now, which is nice. Nice, Ghost is really good. Um, so the stats have switched up a little bit now. So whereas Rowlet had the highest stats before, it's different now on the final evolution. So we're gonna have Typhlosion, he's gonna have the um, highest special attack, highest speed, and overall they have the highest base stats. So it's moved from Rowlet to Typhlosion. Um, and then the Oshawa, they're gonna have the highest HP, highest defense. Um, so they're gonna be more of a defensive built character. Next with um, Rowlet and Decidei, their final form, they're gonna have the highest attack, and the highest special defense. So there we go. Um, like I said, Typhlosion has the highest base attack stats. Um, but, and on top of that, we're like I said, with the first forms, we'll have to look at um, resistances and weaknesses. Oh, I forgot, I forgot. Rowlet is immune to ground attacks. So that, that's also something you should consider. Rowlet is immune to ground attacks because um, they're a flying type. So ground attacks don't affect him, even though he's standing on the ground. <laughs> Um, but Typhlosion, like I said, they have six resistances and they're weak to three types. So that's, that's pretty good. I mean, that's a net three. You have six minus three that brings it to a score of three. That's really pretty cool. They're not, they're not immune to anything. Um, Oshawott's gonna have four resistances with two weaknesses. So four minus two, that's a score of two. And um, 
this side eye is gonna have four resistances, and but they're weak to five types. Five types, that's, whoo, they're more of a, like a glass cannon character where they have a high attack, but they have uh, quite a few weaknesses. So five weaknesses, but they are immune to normal and fighting moves. That's pretty good. I mean, I, that kind of makes up for it in my eyes for Decida also being the best um, final form of the first ones. But Typhlosion, even though they have a, um, a, close, a slow start, eventually they will have the highest base stats. Um, based off of this, I still think Rala is good to start off with and in late game, whereas Typhlosion is probably good in late game. So for a more consistent um, journey with your Pokemon, I would go with Rala as a starter, which is like my first ever grass type endorsement. I never go with grass type. I always go with water or fire. And I, as a player, have never really paid attention to stats since I started this channel. I always just go with the coolest one. So I've always gone <laughs> with the, the coolest looking Pokemon, basically, always. I don't really pay attention to the stats, but knowing this, um, whenever Arceus does come out, I will probably go with Rala just because I mean, none of them are really appealing to me too much. I mean, there's a, a bird, and then we have a, um, a mouse-looking guy, and then we have like a, a otter-looking guy, which I like otters, but in this discussion, Samurai and Oshawott, really, they haven't taken the cake in too much, actually. They, I mean, at the end, they have the highest HP and defense, so they're more of a tankier style of play, which is not really my style. I'm more of an attack, 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 attack. So Rollet with having the highest attack as the beginning and the highest attack as Decido, I, that's great and appealing to me. So this is supposed to be my thoughts on what's the best starter for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like what you saw, subscribe. I appreciate the support. This is Trilogy, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.